What's good? What's happening? What's the crack again there? YouTube. Hey, hey, your good friend Dasmer coming at you with my player action from NBA 2K. Yeehaw. So as we saw, we went up and uh, the box of battled back. That's a little bit of the playoff picture there. So let's get it going, don't you think? Um, was talking to uh, my buddy uh, B.A. And not as in like B.A. Brackus as in Big Asshole. <laughs> and, uh, you know, some ideas uh, I've uh, talked to him about, uh, you know, maybe we can mention you guys. Also about, uh, you know, ways for the game to continue and improve. Because, you know, really like in NBA 2K11, love the direction they've taken the game in. I noticed uh, when I came back, there was yet another update. Seemed to have helped some things. Some things are still kind of eh. But a couple things uh, we can talk about. Uh, there's Andrew Bogut. Andrew. Blah. <laughs> Here's how I'm doing in the playoffs there. So some, and as always, uh, by the way, opening tip-offs and uh, first possessions. So a couple of things I'd uh, probably want to change for NBA 2K11 and especially the My Player, because hey, that's basically what uh, I've been playing almost entirely. Is I like the idea of the offense. You know, let's talk about some positives first. You know, I like the idea of the, what they've done with the offense here. Makes a lot of sense. Um. You know, a little more control on calling defense. And when they tell you you can call plays, maybe you should be able to call plays. <laughs> um, what else? Um, you know, like the little My Jordan thing in there. Uh, maybe, you know, all the Jordan stuff in there. Maybe we could, uh, you know, catch up a little bit uh, maybe uh, you know considering that this game did quite well received quite high critical acclaim as well maybe we could talk about uh, you know some other sponsorship stuff in there but really um, when you think about it at least uh, when I think about it when I talk to uh, you know you know the people I know that are playing this game is that shouldn't the my player mode you know beyond just the, the gameplay shouldn't it also be uh, almost like a role-playing game in a way that you know there's the game stuff and then there's you know other stuff you can do and you think about some of the great uh, rpgs out there and you know i don't know the 2ks exactly got uh you know so much in-house experience with that um you know definitely on the you know the the evil empire oh, and i hate that i hate those fouls i hate that animation but, you know, uh, on the EA side, I mean, they've got Bioware, which is like one of the, you know, <laughs> one of the granddaddy RPG uh, game companies. And there we go. I end up getting subbed out. So when you think about it, and that opens up a whole world of possibilities for the gameplay, making it really intriguing. And, you know, it really becomes a game within a game. Um, I saw a great video with uh, a bunch of great commentators, which... Uh, you know, a, a Shakedown, and I think B5 was in there. You know what? You know, don't get me wrong on that. And they were talking about things they would they would change. That the, definitely the online has really got to change, dude. Like uh, 2K has really got to catch up here. And uh, you know, in a lot of ways, get with the program. And you know, their servers are pretty. You know, don't know if it's a combination of their servers or what it is exactly, but. You know, if they're hoping to get a football game, they're really, really going to have to do a much, much better job um, with the online experience. Uh, because, you know, love them, hate them. Got to give it to EA. How do you like that, eh? Nice move. Get the end one. You know, the at least the online gameplay part uh, for EA is a pretty solid experience. You know... In a lot of ways, though, online console gameplay, it's, you know, the, the way I describe it is it's, uh, it's kind of like, you know, unsupervised recess in kindergarten. <laughs> it's just wild, wild west out there. You know, some people I know, you know, some bigger commentators tell me about, you know, eight foot centers, you know, 99 overall, 
at every you know at every stat out there running around. I mean that kind of stuff. Like, shouldn't that be punished uh, in some way? I mean, isn't that ruining the online experience for everybody? And you know, if you're gonna be a dumbass and doing something like that, you know, you know, you do the crime, you pay, you know, you you pay the time. This is the, this is the way it goes, man. You know, risk reward. Um, it just seems to be, you know, they just seem to be so scared about, uh, you know, customers and, you know, losing customers or some shit. You know, I, myself, I don't get it. You know, it's such a minority of people out there doing this stuff, so. Uh, some other things that definitely need to be changed, uh, at least on the my player part, is sliders, man. They gotta have sliders in there. Uh, there's still a whole bunch of force field nonsense going out there. You can, you can tell... You know, going up for a rebound when the shot's made or not made because you're getting, you know, force field blocked out beforehand. You, know, you get lots of that going on out there. You know, ooh, and I pick up my four charging fell. So, anyways, let's talk a little bit about the game and let's get off, uh, you know, wish list stuff. This game's going pretty well. Don't know if you noticed. We raced out to, uh, we being the Celtics, raced out to a pretty big lead. Uh, you know, Milwaukee slowly but surely battling back here. Always, uh, always a little bit scary when uh, I get, come, I come out of the game. And here we go. All of a sudden, we go from being up double digits to being up by five. You know, nice. <laughs> and I wish there was a little more control in the defense, by the way. Uh, you know, wandering back on, on topic of what I was talking about there. Uh, I wish there was a little more control on defense on uh, those, you know, that animation. You'll, and you see it a couple of times. You do like this sort of hop. You know, a little more, you know, a little more control in the animation. You know, I get that again. You know, that's like the third time that's happened where I get that weird, you know, bunch up in a ball while I'm jumping up in the air thing, end up drawing a foul. Uh, ball tangibility is definitely something. And here we go again. I'm getting yanked out, and we're uh, we're up by two. You know, bite my fingernails. And if you look at my stats there, I've got, you know, this is something else that. Uh, you know, I, you know, I don't know what it is exactly. Was it just because this is the, you know, you know a me ball generation? But, you know, you, this, this is a team game, man. Like, I can't be going out there and scoring almost all the points. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you know, this isn't college basketball where one guy goes out there and dominates. And this isn't basketball in the, you know, the, you know, late eighties or something like that, which was almost like a college game in some ways. You know, where you got your Jordans and Dominic Wilkins and whatnot and going out there and just absolutely, you know, dominating week, game in, game out, season after season. You know, pretty much you had to game plan for them. You know, game plan around them. And there again. Count it. I pick up uh I pick up my final foul. Oh, the the foul thing is definitely I don't know I guess that's something they just can't fix. Maybe it's something that's broken. That, you know, guys will get seven, eight, nine fouls. You get six, you're out of the game. And as you see, we end up losing. No, <laughs> fucking awesome. I'm not too upset. I had a great game. You know, personally, you know, my tune had a great game. And, and this, as you can see, met all of uh, but one objectives. You know, I had I was like half the team's, you know, offensive and rebounding uh, output conference time. So uh, this loss makes, what, three games in a row? What's going on with the team at the moment? <laughs> choke, <laughs> choke. Uh, it's tough to say. I, I think we just have a perfect storm of guys who aren't hitting on all cylinders at the moment. I think as a team, we just need to figure out where things started going wrong and correct that. I urge our fans not to get frustrated, though. We'll be back on track soon. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, pretty nice of me. So that's three losses in a row. I don't know, man. Don't like what direction this is going in. So, as I promised, I was going to get some 2K done. I've actually got the game after this already done. Uh, probably some point this week I'll put it up. And, uh, yeah, no spoilers. <laughs> you just have to stay tuned and uh, watch the posting. So, here's the playoff picture now. Uh, you know, a few teams have already advanced. A few battles out there still going on. And, yeah, Bill Boxer giving us a run for the money. Thanks for watching, YouTube. Check you later this week.